Hi there Brick Builders, today we got a bit of old and new. New for this channel, old for Kobe, who did the Wings Club series a couple of years ago. Here we have Stella's car, the Kobe 25088 from the Wings Club series with 114 pieces, one minifig and a size of 13 by 5.5 by 3.5 centimeters. So let's first have a look at the box. On the front we got a picture of the front of the car and of Stella and Stella in big also. On the back we got a photo of the back of the car and Stella in front of it. On the sides we have different pictures, not directly from the set but from the Wings Club series with a lot of glitter in there as it needs to be. The Wings Club series is a cartoon series originated in Italy in the year 2004 and it's a Nickelodeon product. Kobe defines the set as built for 5 year olds or older. This also leads to the type of instructions we have here. But it's typical for Kobe. You get a lot of sub assemblies, you get grayed out done steps and colored current steps. You don't get really those warnings about similar pieces because there are no such thing as a similar pieces or different radiant slopes and something like that in there. There are no assemblies steps which would be a bit of overkill for 114 pieces in the end we got 25 steps and after that a bit of the other sets in the instruction lab booklet here on the turntable we see the one problem we really have with the set which is the figurine don't get me wrong for a kobe figurine this is fine but it's not really there to put it on studs at least in a sitting position and there is a short skirt on this Stella figurine and this is hard so that she even can't sit down with it without clamping her and she doesn't really fit into there with the skirt on. Okay, you could take it off but I don't know if she should drive in there naked. But I guess we have to consider as fortunate since she doesn't have any wings on her so that's a bonus here. Then we got the sticker sheets in there. Yeah, this one is old enough to have a sticker sheet but we really did only put the one wings sticker on on this car and even that is much less than anything but necessary so everything else is by your thinking there and yes at this time the wings had to be there for the new owner here we got Stella in a bit more zoomed in fashion. She got a chest print, she got a back print, she got a long hair piece, she got a mini skirt, she got two toned feet or painted feet, I don't know really. And she got her mini skirt as an extra thing there. For a Kobe figurine, she's rather pretty. She got her sculpted face and she even got a bit of a sculpt body which makes her uh, much more realistic than other figurines and at the same time not that hilarious that Kobe today produces with its military sets. So I guess you get a bit of both worlds. You get a rather realistic figurine that looks good and at the same time you got something that is not as unrealistic as for example Lego figurines are. So let's measure this car again it's uh, 13 centimeters long 5.5 centimeters wide which is eight studs and 3.5 centimeters in height with that let's open the set as per usual for Kobe the carton contains a print when and where it was produced this time is the 26th of October 2018 and it was done in Milic in Poland of all places 
And that means we can start with the building phase. As may be expected, this set belongs to my daughter and she was the one who built it. So I jumped in to press things together when they needed to, but mainly she did the whole build, the whole 114 pieces here. And since in the last month she delivered a bit of a soft spot for the Wings series, that is what she was eager to do. So what's my take on that? It's a playset, go figure. But it's a good playset, the wheels on the car roll well, it's all Kobe quality here. Yeah, that was expected from Kobe, but you have to say, they do deliver there. There are no odd colors and these are Kobe pieces or Kobe parts and they do have a high clutch power so that while building you have to step in from time to time and put everything really together. But on the other hand it won't fall apart once you drop it or do something to the set. There is a bit of a downside with some of the Kobe vehicles that at one piece of the body there are only two studs that hold this car together so that there is a theoretical failure point there. But that's theoretical with Kobe pieces of course. The figurine I was quite impressed with. It's better, it's prettier than everything I've seen from Kobe in the figurine department previously at least since they used their new figurines. So it's really pretty. That is maybe also something you have to consider when considering this set putting on a shelf. As I said the series is from 2004 so even some kids that are a bit older today so 15 years or so so in the 20s do know these figurines, do know the series and maybe appreciate it. So maybe that's also the clientele who would put this figurine at least on the shelf. Maybe the car also, I don't know. Four parts, this is a 114 pieces set. So there is not much to take there. And of course, again, this is Kobe, so it's Kobe colors. So you really have to have a use for it to take this set as a parts provider. But that's it for another video. If you liked what you've seen, please like this video. If you didn't like what you've seen, please comment me that. And if you really want to have things like this every week, please subscribe. So have fun building, have fun watching, have fun playing and see you.